Good morning, this is Jacqueline with YoungPastorsWife.com. This morning uh, is another Sunday morning, and we're going to go ahead and do another hairstyle. I always put on here ones that I'm in the mood for, so today I'm not really in the mood to do much with my hair, so it's going to be a kind of just basic, basic hairdo. I am going to be putting this headband in. As you can see, it has a flower on it. I'm wearing black and white today, so it matches. And uh, yeah, so I'm not going to part. I'm not going to do a part or anything. What I'm actually going to do is just take my pick, pull the hair up way back here, give it some volume. Turn over to this side, do the same thing. Then around here. I have thick hair, so I kind of have to get a lot of different places, smooth it back a little. Do I have enough? Hmm. I'm going to do a little bit more right here in the middle because that's the part that I want to bump up the most. Okay. Hairspray. Nothing, just kind of full all the way around with your uh, rubber band going in the middle of your hair in the back. Okay. Once I got it in, I'm gonna up again on the top as always. And sometimes this webcam, let me tell you. Let me look in the real mirror. The whole thing is that I don't want it just to be smooth either. Um, I have a thing with smooth hair. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. I like there to be more texture in my hair. So even if I'm having, like today, just keep pulling that same spot can't seem to get this get right there. Um, even if I'm just doing something basic like putting a headband right here, I want my hair to have a little bit of texture on the sides and just a little bit of filling to it. Okay. So now I'm just going to kind of smooth this hair out because I don't brush out my hair in between washings because it breaks it off a lot. So. Sometimes I'll use a pick to smooth it, but um, it causes it to break off when you brush it off a lot if it has hairspray and things on it, so I don't do that. I'm going to go ahead and split my hair in half here in the back, like this, and I'm going to take one side of this, and I'm going to do a little bit of back combing through it. Give it some volume, texture, make it hold in a bun, spray it. Then I'm just going to kind of do a basic, loose, very loose bun. And as you'll see, I'm doing it kind of high. You'll notice keeping that other half of hair separated still. And then I'm going to leave these ends right here about two to three inches of ends I want to have hanging out. Then I'm going to secure them using a big bobby pin and I'm going to stick it kind of in the middle of the bun, press it to my head, and then turn it in. That's what keeps your hair up, putting it more in the middle of the hair that you want to hold. Once again, right here. Okay. Take these little ends. Now I'm going to brush those. Okay, do the same thing to this other side where I'm going to take it and give it just a little bit of texture, helps it stay in its bun. Spray it a little bit, keep those flyaways. 
Now I'm going to do the same thing that I did with that bun, but this one's just going to be a little bit lower down towards my neck, the nape of my neck. I'm going to leave hair out again, but I want to put the hair over to the left side. Get some more pins, stick them in the middle. So in the middle of the hair. And I'm going to use a little one for down here. Okay. And I'm going to go ahead and spray all of this. Pat it down with my hand a little. Okay. I'm going to take these ends that I have. I'm going to curl them. Making sure that when you curl, you get the ends of your hair wrapped around the curling iron. I hate it when I get a curl and then the end is dead. You want to make sure that the end circles around like a perfect ring ringlet as well. So, I'm going to undo the curl. So you see it. And I have one really long string. You can see that. I'm just going to put that string somewhere in my bun. I don't want it in my little curlies. Now, oh, here's what I'm going to do with this. So it didn't curl all the way up at the top. So I'm going to take a small bobby pin and I'm just going to pull that piece of hair up and put a pin in so that the curly part is what we see. I'm going to wrap these little things around my fingers a bit. Spray, spray, spray. I'm going to take another bobby pin and secure them a little bit more just because I like good control of my hair. So I'm going to actually go in like right about here and just kind of connect it to my head a little bit. Very loose pinning, but just so that it stays in place. All right, now back to the front. Since I have my curls on this side, I'm going to want the flower part of my headband on the other side. To even it out. You can do it however you want. That's how I do it. Wrong side. And there we go. I'm ready. Just a really simple, fast type of hairdo for a Sunday morning. All right, God bless you, have a wonderful day.